and burn out the tide, get around people that's going to encourage you. Yeah. Hallelujah. Get around people that's going to encourage you. You're, hey, man, you looking at the wrong stuff on TV, the wrong stuff out there in the world, hanging around the wrong people that got nothing but negativity and nothing but they're bitter and they're they nasty and vengeful and they ain't pouring nothing into your spirit but evil and wickedness and unrighteousness. We got to get away from that kind of stuff. You got to get around some people that's going to encourage you. Some people that are spiritually minded. Some people that's going to encourage you to be saved and want to move forward. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, you got to create an environment that's going to be conducive for spiritual growth. That your faith will be strong in the Lord because if you don't watch it, brothers, so something will come along to get you and to mess you up. So get around some people that's going to keep you strong in the faith. Go to Acts chapter um, 15 and verse number 30, 32. Acts chapter 15 and verse number 32. Judas and Silas also being prophets themselves encouraged the brothers what? With many words and what? Strengthen them. Hallelujah. So you got that man. How do you get around some people and that's going to encourage you and, 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 and watch out for those that want to discourage you. Watch out for those that want to speak negative. That want to speak against the purpose that God has for your life. Oh, you just wasting your time. Oh, you know what? I don't have time for that. Somebody call you, talk that. Oh, you know what? I'll have, I got to go. I, I, I don't have time for that. You know what I'm saying? Somebody come on y'all say, now what? But, uh, let's pray about this because, I, you know, if, if God, uh, let's really make sure that God sent you here. Because if God sent you here, you ought to have something good to say and nothing bad to say. You ought to have something that's going to encourage my soul and edify and build me up. When I see you all and I'm like, oh, man, what is it now? I ought to say, oh, man, oh, brother, we, oh, I know I'm getting some encouragement. I know he got nothing but good words to say to me. How are you going to give me something that's going to build me up and make me want to be strong? When we see each other, we ought to get excited because, Lord, I got something coming good. Something's going to build me up. Something's going to encourage me. Hallelujah. Yeah, man. You know, you ought not be tricked. Oh, man, I know, Lord, I pray. I hope that thing is over. I hope they got something good to say. No, we got to, we all encourage one another. That when we come to church, we ought to encourage one another. Hallelujah. When you're at home, you ought to encourage. One another, encourage the children, encourage the spouse, encourage the neighbors, encourage people around you. Hallelujah, because you want to be an encouraging person. Hallelujah, give God some praise. Let's look at the book of Romans, chapter 1, and verse number 12. Thank you, Lord. Book of Romans, chapter 1, and verse number 12. <laughs> you did 12. Hallelujah. That is, this is Paul speaking, that I that's him. With you, that's what the church of Rome may be, may be encouraged in you. So each of us, by the other's faith. So when I get my faith strong, and around other people with strong faith, we can encourage each other in our faith. I can encourage you in my faith, and you can encourage me in my faith, right? We can encourage one another in each other's faith. Yes, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. So you got to remember, brother and sister, what he said, he said, that I may, that I with you may be encouraged in you, each of us by the other's faith, both yours and mine. Yes. Hallelujah. So my brothers and sisters, I want to tell you, you got to get away from and get, a, get away from discouraging people. Get away from negative people. Get away from people that don't have nothing, never good to say. And then everything that they want to say and talk about is nothing but negativity. Get around somebody that's going to encourage you. Get around somebody that got some strong faith. Because if you don't,
yourself. I want to be edified. I want to be a way people built up and strengthened in the Lord. Hallelujah. So get around people that will encourage you. So point number